As usual say about complete war, it's in the back, really. The head isn't simply protection frame from rain, wine, burn and sun ray. It makes the image you found finished. Our masterclass is the real trail to the magic head world. We will offer literally from nothing by means of extremely simple methods to learn to make stylish hats. Charm women can't live without them. The real dizziness from success is reserved for you. Together with Tatiana Lazareva. Hello, dear viewers. There is no show more interesting than the women trying on hats. She plays all roles of the world repertoire, from Anna Karenina to Elisa Doolittle or Sophie Loren. And the rare man remains indifferent, having caught a glitter of the eyes from under a large and magnificent hat. Our last masterclass has acquainted you with the most simple methods of weaving, but on a flat base. Details in the form of a circle, a rectangle, were filled with threads and the textile materials filled a flat surface of a circle or a square. And if to unite the operations and to get at once the volume form, then you need a head peak. It can be made in the elementary way of old hat, which have already served from felt or from straw. To fill it with small textile waste, to make a bottom and to cover with a fabric, or it's better with dressy. Our pig will be ready, you only will need to fill it with vertical basic threads. Here, the elementary peaks, which became the base for the future head masterpieces. It's very important that vertical threads won't displace during the work. For this purpose, it's necessary to sew a usual cord on perimeter of the bottom part. In the top part, to make an air loop, and also the air loop is necessary in the bottom part of the bottom, strictly on the center that threads will cross only in the center part. You will need to watch that vertical stretch threads will be strong and won't turn during the walk.
By the way, in the history of fashion there are special pages. For example, Elsa Schiaparelli left to us the unique head shoe, the head inkwell or the head from red felt with a cock feather. She worked with the most unexpected materials, created the most unexpected forms. Her lessons were necessary in a severe wartime when French women used for creation of inconceivable designs on a head the most unexpected materials. Fluff, feathers, straw, the velvet and well rest, and even newsprint. Who can that dares? spoke French women. In love as well as in war, all is allowed and the fashion has won. You need the usual sewing needle with big enough eye. And here a material which you will use laying woof threads can be the most different – tapes, sutage, cords. This head is the result of work with cords, and this is with print scraps. The method is simple and good, also because you can use even the smallest scraps. They will create gaudy and very picturesque texture. Join to our textile experiment. We already worked with a head pick, sewing among themselves cords turning a loop. You have a possibility to look how the same cords look when you use the methods of weaving. And besides vertical threads of the base, you also use small textile weights, which are fixed for woof rows. Let's look how we will make it.
The person is in permanent color environment. There are achromatic colors, black, white and gray. And three whales on whom the world of color keeps, yellow, dark blue and red. They make a powerful chord of color palette. They are loved by children, teenagers, often used for the organization of holidays, carnivals, processions. If you have decided to fly a kite, use this combination. Head decorating is real head therapy, a small female holiday. You can use as decorative elements tapes, band, sutage, beads, paints, even feathers. Anything you like. But remember that the head is a frame for the face, and in all, the measure is necessary. We will use for decoration the method of diagonal weaving, threads will settle down obliquely. The element made in the technique of diagonal weaving can be bright addition to a hat. You need either cords or sutage. You pull, fixing threads on a pin. You can simply round cords a pin and can string them one after another through the sharp end. Depending on what elements you will use, the pattern will be frayable if you use cords or flat enough if you use sotash. As we see, the method is simple, but it gives the chance to realize your most courageous imaginations. Now there is a question. How to weave? All is simple enough. You can work from right to left or from left to right, it doesn't matter. But the sequence of threads is important. You begin with the first thread, it consistently binds all vertical threads and comes on the opposite side, and its place occupies a thread number two, which repeats operation. Thus, each subsequent element carries out the same way. I think that you make this simple method directly together with us. It's necessary to start to work, having prepared the basic material. I'm sure that you made all. And if you want to try the most interesting combinations, it's possible to mix in the same elements the most different in color, in texture or thickness cores. And I think that you have paid attention that our tie has different width. We begin to braid with small quantity of elements, and then, equally spaced right and left, we fixed additional threads on woof rows. And thus we reach the width necessary to us. Experiment. You can create using the method of diagonal weaving the handle for a bag, a bracelet, a belt, or is in our case very interesting head addition. Oh. 
By the way, the remarkable artist, the magnificent graphic artist, English fashion designer Philip Tracy is recognized as a king of hatters. In his London workshop there are magnificent hands. They are sprayed, spread, melted by splashes of feathers and light. He claims that a hat is a unique, most simple, most economic and most painless way of plastic surgery. Maybe then we will cease to cut to pieces our tired faces and will simply try on a beautiful and coquettish hat. It's impossible to repeat the unique creations of Philip Tracy, but it's possible to create own hat Tracy. You will need the pig and a piece not glutinous fleecelin, which we will fix on the pig by means of usual pins. We remove the excesses on perimeter and tucks. It is the future pattern of our hat. It simultaneously is a bottom and a crown of our hat. It's a very economic and interesting variant of a pattern. Now we need the pattern of our head brims. During antique times, the peasants went out right in the sun with a disc with a hole inside. Diameter of the hole was 20 cm, that it was convenient to put on a head. We will make the same. The width of brims can be any. You choose the distance independently. The most important thing is that the brim should adjoin beautiful in the face. For this purpose, we also have cut a circle on equal parts, remove the excesses of a brim, so that it will be such half disc. Let's make it together. The head has a basic detail and a brim. We make the basic detail of a piece of glutinous fleecelin. On its surface we fix the most different textile rests, which remind after work. Iron them, and those pieces of textiles which were not fixed, we fix a machine stitch. The stitch can be straight, or any of a reserve of your sewing machine. As you can see, the experiment was successful and all textile elements are strongly fixed on glutinous fleecelin. Now we need to make brim details. At first they are cut out equal on the size. And then from one of details we from different directions cut off 2 mm and join the top and bottom detail as equal. 
It's necessary that the external seam softly will roll on inside and the right side will be beautiful. That the head brim will be beautiful, take advice. Advice number one. You cut out the top and bottom details not equal on the size. The bottom detail from each side will be less on 2 mm. Advice number 2. You stitch together the top and bottom detail with fullness. Advice number 3. You iron the seam of ground of details. And advice number 4. You cut off joint margin stairs. On the top detail it's necessary to cut off much more seams than on the bottom. If you keep all advices, you will have very beautiful transitive edging. By the way, in 17th century, the ladies decorated their heads with anything. It could be feathers of exotic birds, an ostrich, a heron. Sometimes they reminded a picturesque still life and sometimes an exotic bed. Today in Burma, ladies wear on their heads not thoughtless heads, but useful or subjects and sometimes rather impressive sizes. Good ideas for hatters are prompted by the world nature. Worth a look. Thus, it's very important not to lose a hat. The master class is finished. Take advice. If you are not decide to go out in a beautiful hat, hang up it near to a mirror, try on and tell to yourself, I am beautiful. After all, it's very harmful not to go to the ball, especially when you deserve it. I wish you good luck, goodbye for the moment. Today with you there was Tatiana Lazareva.